Welcome in the learning corner. You are with your teacher, teacher at Anas. My dear children, please watch this video carefully and answer the questions at the end of it. And remember to send them to your teacher for the constructive feedback. Today's topic is filling in the missing numbers. The subject is mathematics P4. By the end of this unit, you will be able to solve missing number problems involving addition and uh, subtraction. Today we want to go far away from these two application, two operations, sorry, addition and uh, subtraction. We are going to add and subtract so that we can find the missing numbers. Let's have arithmagon. What is an arithmagon? An arithmagon is a polygon with numbers at its vertices and some of these numbers determine the numbers written on its edges. We have two parts. We have vertices. We also have edges. To find the number written on edges, we add the numbers at the vertices. A polygon is just like uh, any shape with more than two sides let's have example number one finding missing numbers on the edges we are going to focus on edges first let's have an example of an arithmagon here we are given uh, three numbers written at the vertices and we are asked to find the numbers written on edges how do we do it here, the numbers 7, 9, and 12 are at the vertices of the arithmagon, and the unknown numbers are at the edges. To find the numbers written on the edges, add the numbers at the vertex to get the number on the edge. What is it? To find this missing number here, we have to take 12 plus 9 and then the answer we write it here on the edge. That is what he said here. To find the number on the edge, add the number at the vertices. So 12 plus 9 is 21. So 21 is put between 9 and 12. 9 plus 7 is 16. So the 16 is put between 9 and 7. 12 plus 7 is 19. So 19 is put between 12 and 7. We have added the number at the vertices to find the number on the edge. That is the first example. So let's now out the number at the center and the number at the vertices. So here we have an example. This example shows that the missing numbers are at the vertex. But we are given the numbers on the edges. How will we find the numbers at the vertices? First of all, we have to find the number at the center. How do you find the number at the center? To find the number at the center, divide the sum of numbers on the edges by 2. What does it mean? You take 20 plus 18 plus 16 and then you divide all of them or you divide the answer by 2. 20 plus 18 plus 16 divided by 2. We get what? We get 27. I think you can do it and then you find the answer is 27. So our number in the center or at the center is 27. So now we can use that number 27 to find the number at the vertices. How do you find the number at the vertices given the number on edges and the number at the center? So the technique is very simple. What do we do? 
we take the number in the center minus the number on edge and then we put the answer in opposite on opposite side of the edge to mean we put it here 27 minus 18 we put the answer here 27 minus 16 we put the answer here so 27 minus 20 we put the answer here so subtract the number in the center with the number on the edge to find the number at the vertex opposite to the edge 27 minus 16 is 11 you can do it and then you find 11 here we go on 27 minus 18 is 9 and 27 minus 18 is 9 9 is put at opposite side of the edge 27 minus 20 is equal to 7 7 is put at opposite side of the edge that you have used here we were finding the number at the vertices but before we find them you have to find out the number in the center by adding the number on edges and then you divide the answer by two and to find the number at the vertex or at the vertices you take the number in the center minus the number at the on the edge and then you write the number at opposite uh, opposite side of the edge that you have used example number three fill in the missing number here we are having a square it is not a triangle but the game is the same to find the number in on edge here you have to add the two numbers at the vertices and then you write the answer here in the middle on the edge in in this arithmagon there are four numbers at the vertices namely two seven three and twelve two plus seven is nine and then we put nine where in the middle between two and the seven seven plus three is ten we put our answer here 3 plus 12 is equal to 15. We put our answer here, 15. 12 plus 2 is equal to 14. We put our answer here. So the game is the same. To find the number at the vertices, we do what? We first find the number in the middle, and then we use it to find the number at the vertices by subtracting the number in the center by the number on the edge to find the number on edge please add the number at the vertices and then you put the answer there between those two vertices that you have used thank you very much you can just go back you restart you watch this video again you rewatch it again so that you can do these questions we have four questions and these questions are all about filling in the missing number. Please watch the video again so that you can do these questions correctly. And remember, after, after doing these questions, send the answers to your teacher for marking and for feedback. Thank you very much. And remember to subscribe here on this youtube channel and ring the bell for the next notifications or the next lessons thank you very much be blessed